United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres has appealed to U.S. President Joe Biden to lift or waive all sanctions on Iran as agreed under a 2015 deal. UN Under Secretary General for Political and Peace Building Affairs Rosemary DiCarlo echoed Guterres's uh, report to the UN Security Council. The 15-member council discussed the Secretary General's biannual report on the implementation of the 2015 resolution that enshrines the nuclear deal between Iran, United States, France, Britain, Germany, Russia, and China. I echo the Secretary General's appeal to the United States to lift or waive its sanctions outlined in the plan, extend the waivers with regard to the trade in oil with Iran, and to once again facilitate nuclear-related activities consistent with the plan and the resolution. These activities relate to non-proliferation projects including at the Bashir nuclear power plant, the Fordow facility, and the Iraq reactor. We also call on Iran to fully cooperate with the IAEA in accordance with its NPT-required Comprehensive Safeguards Agreement to resolve the outstanding safeguards issues without further delay. Beyond Iranian nuclear activity, Iran's support for terrorism threatens U.S. forces diplomatic personnel, and our partners in the region and elsewhere. It drives instability and negatively impacts millions of civilians. We will continue to use all tools at our disposal to counter Iran's destabilizing activities in the region and to promote implementation of other Security Council resolutions to address Iranian conventional weapons proliferation including 1701's prohibition on the unauthorized transfer of arms and related material to Hezbollah in Lebanon. Those who broke their promises are the ones who must prove their sincerity and genuine political will. They are the ones who must take hard decisions. Therefore, they are not in a position to criticize Iran for taking remedial measures which are fully authorized under the deal. It's clear that time is not on our side and that what might be possible still today may pro prove impossible in the near future. We have a limited window ahead of us that we should not miss. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.